Good morning, Lakeside Alliance. Welcome back from a three-day weekend. Today is Tuesday, September 6th. I'm Jesse, and I'm here with... Emmanuel. Today's news brought to you by Teen Leadership. Today is the start of our first beer week. Did you remember to dress in a DC or Marvel attire? We hope you did, so you don't miss out on a big payday. Anyone who dressed today and any day this week will get four Warbucks added to their bank account. Tomorrow is Hawaiian Day. Wear a flower in your hair. A flower shirt or a LA or any Hawaiian themed outfit you can think of. Thursday is Jersey Day to kick off the NFL season, but you can wear any jersey from any sport. Friday is my favorite. Disney Day. Pull out those ears any, or any other Disney d gear you have and get paid Friday. Our, school, our first school dance will be September 21st. We hope you are looking forward to showing your dance moves. Don't forget our Roar poster contest due date is this Friday, just a few days away. So if you are participating in the contest, don't forget the due date on Friday. Changing gears. There are still some leftover yearbooks from last year if you like one. Go to room 305 after school with $25 cash. Speaking of yearbooks, we are starting yearbook applications for new students to join this year. Do you love capturing memories? Lakeside Yearbook is taking applications now. Come by room 305 for more information and an application. Everyone should now have this year's Lakeside Middle School Planner. We will begin grade checks every Thursday starting this week. A message will go out to your parents Thursday evening as a reminder for you to get your planner signed. When you come to school on Friday with your grade check and signature completed, you will get paid. We will also be starting our strict tardy policy today. If you, if you did the scavenger hunt, you are aware where your tardy cards are located in your planner and what the consequences are for each day. Make sure you get to class on time every period, every day. If you feel like you, if you have not yet received your planner, make sure to ask your advisory teacher. Be careful not to lose your planner because if you are tardy and you do not have your planner, it will be an automatic referral and an automatic after school detention. Did you know that September is Suicide Prevention Month? This month we will be watching some videos to help us ourselves if we need down or we know someone who's struggling. Let's take a look at our first video called MTC.
Thank you for watching. If you are struggling, please reach out to any adult who you feel comfortable speaking with. Your counselors, your teachers, er, and, and everybody else on campus is here to support you. Greetings and salutations, Lakeside Middle School, and happy Tuesday to everyone. Hey, folks, we are in the month of September, and September is Suicide Prevention Month. You can look forward to lunchtime activities presented by our Friday Night Live, our restorative practitioners, and maybe even our ASB will participate and take part in some of these things because we want our students to know that we are here for you. They're going to have topics like how do you report concerns about others? How do you report concerns that you have when it comes to yourself? How, who do you report those concerns to? And all different types of resources to help our students and not only to just help our students, but to help you as students help someone else. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a responsibility to do our very best and to help ourselves in, in whatever ways we can. But we also have a responsibility to speak up for those who have trouble speaking up for themselves and to help one another. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, please visit the tables, participate in the lunchtime activities because you can get a lot of useful information and some enjoyment about learning uh, about suicide prevention. We want everyone to be happy and healthy and we want everyone to do well. So please, please, please take advantage of the resources that are provided. Also, ladies and gentlemen, we have about two and a half weeks until the end of our very first grading period. That means we get to give out our PAC awards. That's right. PAC stands for Phenomenal Academics, Attendance, and Citizenship. And you can get PAC if you have a 3.0 GPA or higher. No tardies to periods two through seven. No discipline, no confiscations, and no dress code. Having these items will allow you to get PAC. Now we have two levels to PAC. The first one is our, just, it's PAC. Uh, you have to have two out of three of those. Don't know where my fonts are off, but they look better before. And when you get our pack, you will get out of class 10 minutes early for your lunch dismissal on a specialized day. And you will have a special lunch treat on that day. It could be anything. It could be popsicles. It could be candy. It could be chips. I don't know. It could be just the special treat for students who are uh, who got at least who got two out of three of these folks of these guys right here. Now, our platinum pack, you get everything in pack, but you also get a free lunch truck treat. And for our first grading period, that lunch truck is Kona Ice. That's right. We'll have Kona Ice trucks here at Lakeside Middle School for those students who get all three of these, meaning they have a 3.0 GPA. They have no tardy superiors two through seven. They have no discipline, no confiscations, and no dress code issues. So, ladies and gentlemen, maybe you didn't make pack this time hey, you know what? There's another chance in the next grading period because this starts over every single grading period. And for those of you who want to know, no, our second break grading period lunch truck is Carl's Jr. So if you didn't get platinum pack this time, you might want to work to get platinum pack next time because that is a free lunch, free Carl's Jr. lunch. Ask some of our eighth graders that received pack last year. They got to line up and get a free Carl's Jr. lunch. I think we had three choices. We had Famous Star, Famous Star with Cheese, and we had Chicken Stars. Those were the three lunches that you got to choose from. And then you got um, the sandwich or the Chicken Stars, and you got fries, and you got a drink. So, and that happened on campus during lunch. So, ladies and gentlemen, uh, that Kona ice truck will be here. And so we, are, we look forward to celebrating our students who have earned pack. Uh, additionally, folks, got some bad news for you. Some of you um, have been chewing gum on campus and we've allowed it. But now we've gotten to the point where people are not disposing of their gum properly. They're going into classes where teachers have said there is no gum in their class. And they are taking advantage of the fact that we have allowed gum. Your parents received a notification on Sunday. There is no gum allowed at Lakeside Middle School at all. We tried it, but people took advantage of it and did not handle it properly. So folks, that means there's no gum. If you bring gum on a campus, it will be confiscated. It will not be given back, ladies and gentlemen. If you are chewing gum in class, you will have to spit it out. If you are chewing gum on campus, you will have to spit it out. Do not bring gum to school at all, folks. It is absolutely, positively not allowed. 
And on a good note, tomorrow is our Hawaiian Day, and we have a special treat for you Lakeside Middle School students. Everyone will receive a lay when they enter the gate or arrive at school. And during the day, we will have a school-wide game of rock, paper, scissors. That's right. Here it says rock, scissors, paper. I like saying rock, paper, scissors. And anyone with a lay can challenge someone else to a game of rock, paper, scissors. Just one game. Not like 12 rounds. One round, people. One round. The winner of that one round gets the lay. And that person with the lay can keep challenging people all day long. And when, during seventh period, there's going to be an announcement for students to come up um, to the front office, I believe is what we're going to do. And we're going to give gift cards to people with the most lays. That's right. So, ladies and gentlemen, make absolutely sure. Don't cheat. Don't grab anybody else's lay. If you're caught trying to take something from someone, you are going to be completely out of the game for the entire day. If anyone sees somebody on campus trying to take something from someone else, trying to take a lay from another person, you will not only be out of the game, but we'll go ahead and call your parents to pick you up. And somebody might say, oh, you being extra, Dr. Kenny, it's not that serious. It is that serious because we need to keep our hands to ourselves. It's not yours. If you didn't win, you didn't win. And those of you who, if you don't win a rock, paper, scissors game, give up your lay. All right. And you have to give up. Well, so let's say, for instance, you have five lays. Well, if someone beats you at rock, paper, scissors, you have to give them all five of those lays. So challenge wisely, folks, and challenge carefully, ladies and gentlemen. But we look forward to a riveting and exciting game of rock, paper, scissors, school-wide on Wednesday. All right, students, we want you to know we believe in you. Ladies and gentlemen, we have over a 1,000 students at Lake Tide Middle School, almost 1,100 students. I'm not going to know all of your names. Um, I'm not going to know who all of you are, but I want you to know as the principal of this school, I want to speak to you every day. I want you to know that you have teachers and instructional aides and administrators and office staff and custodians and uh, classify all of our classified staff members. We believe in you all. And we want you to believe in yourselves. So that's why we have these schools, school-wide expectations to be respectful, organized, accountable and, accountable and responsible. Because these are the types of things that will set you apart from other people as you transition through this thing called life. Some of you have not been displaying these expectations. You've been keep, you, you haven't been keeping your hands to yourself. You've been placing things on social media that are wrong and inappropriate. You have been saying inappropriate things in classrooms. You've gotten referrals for inappropriate behavior. Ladies and gentlemen, I say this to you. We have a way that we can handle disagreements and it is not by putting your hands on another person. Because when it comes down to it, it's not going to you can't make someone do something. But you can talk through your issues with them so that we can get a resolution. This is why we have our counselors, we have our restorative practitioners, we have our administrators here on campus. We are here to support you and we believe in each and every one of you. We have our teachers that can help you through things. We have our instructional aides. We have a wealth of people with a wealth of knowledge to be able to support each and every one of you. So please, ladies and gentlemen, I'm asking you, follow our school-wide expectations because if you don't, the consequences for not doing that are way worse than just doing what we're supposed to do. So folks, let's be respectful, organized, accountable, and responsible. Let's do our very best every single day. Let's get to class, each, every class, on time, every day. Because you're here at school to learn, we're at, here at school to support you and help you learn. I know your lions, you know your lions by our roar. Because we do the things that we're supposed to do each and every day. We believe in you students. For those of you who have been doing well, keep up the good work. For those of you who have had some hiccups and some issues, that's okay. Now, is, now you can start to do better. And we want to see everyone at Lakeside Middle School doing the absolute very best. That is all I have for you today, Lakeside. This is your principal, Dr. Kenny, the one and only, and I'm out. That's all we have for today, Lions. Please follow us on Instagram and Twitter at LakesideVVUSD. Don't, Don't forget, forget to be respectful, organized, accountable, and responsible. Roar. Have a great spirit week.
拜。Bye